we have a diagnostic laboratory system that's housed in the College of Veterinary Medicine, and this diagnostic lab system is throughout the state and supports the entire state. We have the location here that's primarily supporting our small and large animal teaching hospitals. We also have a diagnostic laboratory in Pearl, Mississippi. There's really two laboratories, sister laboratories at that facility. One is the Mississippi Veterinary Research Diagnostic Laboratory, as well as the Poultry Veterinary Diagnostic Laboratory at that same location. And we also have the Aquatic Research and Diagnostic Lab that supports the aquaculture industry in Stoneville, Mississippi. So the laboratory system is, is quite broad and serves the state in many different ways. The whole lab system is huge from the importance of what it does for our state, our state's economy. Our diagnostic lab system is kind of behind the scenes here at the CVM, but I think we provide a very vital service. We provide services for our small animal hospital here at the CVM and our large animal hospital, as well as other services. So wildlife, aquatic animals, our food fish programs, we have diagnostics related to all of those species. So through our various diagnostic labs, our goal, whether it's through necropsy and histology or microbiology or ClinPath is to provide the best, most accurate diagnosis we can for our client with a fast turnaround time. And so this to me is a very rewarding part of my job because we are serving the greater veterinary community and helping them in turn provide the, the highest level of care that they can for their patients. We have two labs here in Pearl, that's the MVRDL, the Mississippi Veterinary Research and Diagnostic Lab, the PRDL, the Poultry Research and Diagnostic Lab. The MVRDL sees all species including a wide variety of production animals, equine, small animals and other companion animal species, as well as wildlife, zoo and exotic species. We offer diagnostic services to veterinarians, producers, as well as companion animal owners to protect animal health and animal agriculture in the state of Mississippi, as well as human health. Our laboratory is also uh, doing important testing for chronic wasting disease. This is a, an important disease for animals, but also is an important environmental contamination issue. And the laboratory is playing a very important role detecting this problem in the, uh, in the field. Field, and they are making a difference in the control of chronic wasting disease in our state. It's really, really important for the state of Mississippi, and I think it's a, it's a really good thing for our students. The Poultry Research and Diagnostic Laboratory is dedicated to the diagnosis of diseases in commercial poultry. The first agricultural commodity of Mississippi is poultry. That's the reason that this laboratory is a very important part of our system. And the poultry lab can diagnose diseases diseases like salmonella and the majority of the testing is regulatory testing. Um, so this is for diseases like avian influenza that you may have heard of. The broiler flocks have to be tested for avian influenza prior to going to the processing plant and all of that testing for Mississippi is done in our laboratory in the PRDL, um, specifically in the poultry serology section. So it's, it's really important the testing that we do here to safeguard um, the food chain. Here at the Aquatic Research and Diagnostic Lab in Stoneville, Mississippi, the lab's role is to provide diagnostic services for the catfish farmers. When they have issues with their ponds, they'll bring fish in and they'll bring water samples at the same time for us to analyze and to provide answers so they'll know how to manage uh, the disease problems. Catfish industry is the largest food fish production industry in the United States. The Mississippi Delta is the heartbeat of the catfish industry. Right here, our, our deep aquifers provide for the best habitat for growing fingerlings, which supply the whole catfish industry. We have the potential to have a lot of impact because a lot of the strategies that we develop here at Stoneville can be readily implemented and field tested in the industry due to our proximity to uh, the majority of the producers. We out here at Bear Creek are always using Mississippi State to come out here and do experiments. Staying on top of research has helped this farm be successful through the years and I think it's helping other fish farmers be successful also. I bet you I talked to somebody from Mississippi State once a week at least uh, on, about something catfish related. Thank you.